So there's some buzz about the upcoming iPhone SE 4, and it looks like Apple just dropped a not so subtle hint about its processor. Originally, there were whispers that the SE 4 would be rocking the A18 Bionic chip, but hold on, things might be taking a different turn. With the recent launch of the iPad Mini 7, we're getting some clarity on what to expect from the iPhone SE 4. Apple introduced the iPad Mini 7 with the A17 Pro chipset, the same powerhouse that's in the iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max. This chip isn't just a fancy name. It brings some serious performance boosts and supports Apple's latest and greatest features, including their advanced AI tech. Let's break it down a bit. The A17 Pro has a snappy 6-core CPU, made up of two high-performance cores and four efficiency cores. That means you're looking at a sweet 30% jump in CPU performance compared to the previous generation. Plus, it's got a 5-core GPU that boosts graphics performance by around 25%. So whether you're gaming, editing photos, or diving into augmented reality, this chip really enhances the experience. It's a game changer for professionals in fields like design, medicine, and aviation too. Given all that power packed into the A17 Pro, it's starting to seem like Apple might skip the A18 chip for the SE4 in favor of this more cost-effective option. After all, previous reports that predicted the iPad Mini 7 would use the A18 chip turned out to be way off base. So who knows? Maybe the SE4 will follow a similar route. Now let's talk about why the iPhone SE4 is such a big deal. With the iPhone 16 series not performing as well as Apple hoped, they're looking to bridge that sales gap with this new release. The SE4 aims to pack in the latest features and hardware to really entice buyers and boost those numbers. Rumor has it the design could take some inspiration from the classic iPhone 4, which is super exciting. There's chatter about possibly ditching Touch ID for Face ID and swapping out the older LCD for a shiny 6.1-inch OLED display, complete with a sleeker notch. And get this, the SE4 is expected to be the first special edition model to support Apple's advanced AI features, thanks to a generous bump to 8 gigs of RAM and the A17 Pro chip. That's some serious power for advanced AI capabilities. As for pricing, the SE4 is likely to start at around $499 for the base model. Not too shabby. If we look back, the iPhone SE3 dropped in March 2022, so we could be seeing that SE4 make its debut around March 2025. By then, Apple should have a fully stable version of its AI tech ready to roll, which might just make this phone a hot commodity right out of the gate. So, what do you all think? Are you pumped about the iPhone SE 4 and its processor? Any predictions on how it might perform once it's out? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I can't wait to hear what you think. Until next time, take care.